Hello everyone, thank you for coming today. Our group session will be Build Your Own Life Pack. My name is Joe Tan, I'm an occupational therapy student with Grand Valley State University. Before we get started, is everyone here familiar with occupational therapy? Have you heard of it before? Uh, don't they help you get a job? That's a good question. As an occupational therapist, I'm here to help each of you improve your overall health and wellness through independence and uh, participation in daily activities and routines. While it's uh, different for all of you, um, I'm focused on what you're able to do, and most importantly, it's basically what's most important to your daily lives and what you'd like to do. Examples include self-care, that could be like putting on your clothes or you know, going to work, um, leisure activities, like you like to play cards you know, with friends, social interaction, you know, meeting with people, and also community mobility, you know, going to the store to get groceries, or whatever you like to do with them. Now that you know about me, let's take a minute to know about you. Um, can each of you introduce yourself? Tell me a favorite hobby or activity, and if you have time, you know, something interesting as well. If you'd like to. Uh, my name is Nina, and I like to get together with friends and play cards and play bingo and just play games. Oh, great. Okay. Um, my name is Kate, and uh, in my spare time, I really like to read and write. My name is Oksana, and I really enjoy shopping. And I'm Sean, and I like to take care of things at home. Okay, great. Thanks for sharing, everybody. Today, as we said, we're building our own life pack, and this is going to be a, your own personalized pack that will help you do those activities that you like to do. For example, this is a flashlight, and that can help you when it's dark outside and you know, you're going to take out the garbage that you like to do, that way you can see and safely get to where you need to go. Highlighters here can be used to mark, you know, different pill bottles, so that way you know which type of um, medication you're taking. And that's especially great when you're, you know, you're out in the community, you know, you, know, you don't have time, that way you know which you know, pill you need to take with that. So, now that I've discussed it, um, to help you get through your day. Before we start our activity today, we're, it's a team activity, so we're going to need to set some ground rules so everybody gets the most out of the application. Um, basically, respect everyone, take turns talking, and respect that everybody, you know, everybody's opinion. Encourage and support each other. You know, feel free to participate and get the most out of the activity. And basically, just have fun and just trying to help each other throughout the day and kind of take something from this group activity. Okay, so for Nina, you like to play cards. Uh -huh. um, an, an item we have here that might be helpful for you is we have these playing cards oh, that are um, great. You know, the larger so you can read them and you can actually maybe have to be able to see, you know, help you with playing the game. Um, is there any other items that you think would be helpful? So let's say Nina was going out to McDonald's and she had to meet friends to play, you know, she likes to play um, Euchre. What, what item? Are there items here that you think would be helpful? Anybody here? Do you think? Maybe um, like a magnifying glass. Would that help to be able to see the items? Oh, great. So we have a magnifying glass here. If they didn't have the special cards or... Right, so it'd be great to just um, you know, check signs if you were you know, riding the bus or... Or maybe read the cards. Yeah. Or read the cards yeah. as well, yeah. right. And That's a good idea. Read or Flashlight maybe? Sometimes. Oh, that's really helpful. Maybe they're being yeah, a night. Speaking. If it's dim lighted. Yeah, sometimes I feel like I need extra light to see better. Okay, so those are, those are some great ideas. Thanks for sharing. And Sean enjoys being, um, taking care of his home and being a homemaker. So let's say Sean has to uh, go do some laundry. An item that would be helpful for Sean is possibly the tape here. You know, he could uh, lay some tape on the steps. And that way, you know, he knows what steps he's stepping on because he'll, he'll be able to see the tape better than just you know, the stairs by themselves. And it'll also provide more grip. I, I also find that I have trouble um, taking care of the money at home. Oh, great. Just, okay. uh, I'm, you know, depending on the lighting and where I'm at, it's not always very easy to calculate our bills. Okay, okay. So, uh, so Sean, I wanted to share with you an idea friend of mine shared with me that the bills can be folded in a certain way 
So if you ask somebody to pre-fold some bills for you, okay. then uh, maybe that's going to be helpful. Oh, the money? Okay, mm -hmm. yeah. And also, um, I, I have a, a calculator with very big buttons at home, or you could just use maybe a magnifying glass. Is that what this is? Is that, okay. Yeah. Something like yeah, this that you have at home? If I have the one with even larger. Oh, yeah, that is, I've been trying to work with tiniest calculator. It's not really been working out very well. So that would be great. Mm -hmm. Hey, thanks for sharing. Um, Oksana enjoys shopping. So a life pack item here that might help Sean, uh, Oksana. Um, for example, we have a walking stick here. This could help her guide her way through the mall or you know, getting out of the car. Um, the money folding? Money folding money would be folding an excellent yeah, idea. The money folding would work for that as well. You um, could use the magnifying glass also. Or a magnifying glass would be great for like, if you're trying to find, let's say you're looking for an item for your grandchild or a friend, trying to find a certain size. You use a magnifying glass to, to read the labels, yes. Size. What, what would we use these for? Yeah, what would you use this for? I mean, obviously the rubber bands, uh, but why? What? Why are they part of the kit? Basically, it's just um, any any day to day life situations you might run into. For example, I think mean, could we use it with her shopping? We could use a shopping. That's a, that's a good question. Um, I I was just thinking about it, the the bill folding, and we could also I mean rubber bands could be used in different ways for the money to determine which bills you have. I guess that's a great idea. She could I, I, she I, could put her. Uh, or fives together or by denomination or let's say she had a bill to pay and she just had a certain amount of money and she just wanted to put together beforehand and um, that would be great to just be able to pull out and be easier instead of counting you know when she got to uh, the place that she had to go so it's a great idea Sean. or you sure. could put a rubber band on a certain credit card that you use just to make sure you get the correct oh. credit card that was just an idea so, I had here yeah. yeah I also got another idea about uh, rubber bands I like buying different varieties of um, beans. So maybe if I use magnifying glass at the store, I can identify different varieties of beans with one or two rubber bands. Hmm. Yeah, good idea. that's a good, good. That's so a good idea. When I'm at home and retrieving those cans from the uh, cupboard, I can already you know, have an idea what, what food is in that particular that's great. can. Yes, these are just Basically, these items are just to get you started. You know, this is going to be your own personal kit, and you can add or, or take out you know, whatever you like to take out, depending on your, your experiences, what you like to do. Um, lastly, with Kate, Kate likes to walk her dog. I do. I have big dogs. <laughs> I um, like my dog. You know, an item I can think of just from what we have here. There's a Ziploc bag, she can color code it and just have the, you know, the food for the dog. Or um, okay. any items that, because you're going to walk with a dog or something. Mm -hmm. That way you could just separate the items and it's quick to grab out of your life pack. So maybe like treats in one yeah, bag. Treats in one bag. And, yeah. and, and, maybe dog medication in another bag. And if she's walking at night, she can use a flashlight. Mm -hmm. Definitely, a flashlight's a great idea. Or the walking stick. And the walking, walking stick. stick, yeah. The walk stick, all the way. Okay. Thanks for sharing, everybody. Um, Basically, you know, this is just to get you started with a life pack. Um, it's up to you to pick which items you like and which you feel will be the, mo the most helpful for you. Mm -hmm. And I like that each of you offered suggestions. That's what the group is about, trying to help each other with their daily life um, activities and routines. And then from now, um, very helpful. Yeah. Any, do you guys have any questions? Or